With the rise in obesity, diabetes, and other weight-related diseases, people are becoming more and more conscious about what they eat. As a result, people who are overweight are having to limit their food intake because they are not consuming sufficient amount of calories and nutrients. However, if you are not aware of the foods that should be included in your daily diet and the ones that should be taken in moderation, you are most likely going to be overweight. The following are some of the best glycemic foods that you should include in your daily diet. Well, the following foods are not as popular as the top known foods, but they are still very good for your health and play an important role in having a healthy diet. In this category of the best glycemic foods is the popular peanut. Although peanuts are rich in protein, they are also rich in the glycemic index. Therefore, they contain carbohydrates, which do not play a big role in raising glucose levels in the body. Nevertheless, nuts and seeds are a good source of protein and are also rich in various other nutrients. Another great choice in the glycemic foods is the common peanut. Not only is it rich in protein but it also has a large amount of fiber. Most health experts would recommend that you eat peanuts but for any healthy person, it is going to be better to eat raw peanuts. The biological properties of protein in peanuts are quite different from those in digestible protein, which means that peanuts may reduce the activity level of the immune system for certain individuals. For many of the famous foods, there is only a very limited amount of information that is available for the athletes and healthcare providers. One of the best information for these people is the glycemic food index list, which has numerous serious food results that help in raising blood glucose levels at certain intervals. With the glycemic index list, you can easily determine which foods will increase your glucose levels the most and help you choose the right type of food for your diet. This is a great help for the healthcare system as well as for athletes who are trying to balance their high-calorie diets with enough nutrients. Processed meats are foods that have been processed and most of the nutrients and fiber have been removed. They should be taken in as little amount as possible. Fresh fruits are types of fruits that are a lot more processed and don't really contain a lot of nutrients. When choosing the fruits you are going to eat, make sure that they are of a good consistency and are not watery. Whole grain foods are foods that have not been processed and therefore retain a lot of the nutrients and fiber that is originally found in grains. Since grains are a great source of fiber, you should make sure to get a great amount of fiber from your grains as well. Examples of foods that are made from whole grains are brown rice, corn, and wild rice. Legumes are beans that are inedible in their natural state. Examples of legumes are garbanzo beans, kidney beans, lentils, and split peas. These vegetables are very healthy and plentiful, and there are so many recipes and dishes that can be derived from them. Soya products are products in which some of the milk has been processed, particularly to make it less acidic. Containing soy include tofu, soy milk, soy beans, soy cheese, and edamame. Since foods that contain a glycemic index are very healthy, it would be wise to use them in your daily diet. Just remember that processed foods can contain unwanted toxins and chemicals that can lead to many kinds of diseases. If you are interested in starting a much healthier diet, you can try making a list of the glycemic index foods you have chosen. If you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and press the bell icon for latest updates and don't forget to subscribe.